New tonight, a push to improve communication with police and the deaf or hard of hearing drivers. It's a new initiative to try to help to relieve stress. CBS 12's Lulu Ortiz joins us live with how Boynton Beach police hope to ease the already tense interactions. Lulu. Well, the city and the Boynton Beach Police Department, they teamed up to give away a product called the Pullover Pal that will help overcome the communication barrier. We're told there are about 60,000 people here in Palm Beach County who are deaf or hard of hearing. And so the city hopes this will inspire surrounding municipalities to do the same. Well, really, it's amazing. It's awesome. It's so good. Like many drivers, so Walter Sarasoli you know, has been pulled over for a traffic violation. His sign language interpreter, Beth Wagmeister, explains what that was like for him. I just point to show that I'm deaf, and we write back and forth. I say, why do you stop me? That's basically how we've been doing it. If history repeats itself, or if there's an emergency on the road, Sarasoli says he will now feel at ease using the pullover pal document holder. It folds over the driver's window so an officer can see it immediately when approaching the vehicle. It contains a card telling the officer the driver is deaf. But with that card, it would reduce the danger and it would be a huge improvement. I really appreciate the support for the deaf and hard of hearing drivers. It explains that the driver cannot hear you. Debbie Majors you with know, the city of Boynton Beach it says it also holds insurance and registration documents. Right now, she says, officers carry a card filled with icons that the driver or officer can point to, but that's not enough. They go to another city and they don't have this and the communication is an issue. Majors says now deaf or hard of hearing drivers will have something available for them wherever they go. We want everyone who needs one to have one. Now, officers will give away these products during their city commission meeting this Thursday night. Now, the product owner lives in North Carolina. We spoke to him earlier tonight. He says he's so happy to help those here in Boynton Beach. And he also says he's very glad he was able to ship these items right before the storm hit his area. We're live tonight in Boynton Beach. Lulie Ortiz.